Issues related to Hong Kong have been one of the main highlights of this year's two sessions. For more analysis, let's now talk to Mr. Lawrence Ma. He's the director of China Law Society and chairman of the Hong Kong Legal Exchange Foundation. Welcome to the show, Mr. Ma. Well, the first question is that Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi has highlighted the principle of patriots administering Hong Kong for the steadfast and successful implementation of the one country, two systems principle. So how are these two concepts related? Well, um, the patriot leader Deng Xiaoping said in 1984 that the one country, two system principle could only be effectively implemented if Hong Kong is run by patriots. Some people in those days tried to differentiate between resumption of sovereignty on one hand and the resumption of the right to govern. Now, the British Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher in those days was trying to persuade uh, Deng Xiaoping to continue British governance in exchange for the resumption of sovereignty to China. Now, that was emphatically rejected. For these so many years, the right to govern has not been fully resumed and rest within the hands of the patriots. And now it is the time for a full and complete resumption of the right to govern. Well, Ms. Ma, can you explain to us a little bit about what is the exact meaning of patriots in Hong Kong? Uh, well, patriotism is not a vague concept. It requires a person to first sincerely safeguarding national sovereignty, national security, and national development interest. Second, the patriot has to respect the fundamental system of the country and the constitutional order of the city, which is Hong Kong. And third, doing one's utmost to maintain Hong Kong's prosperity and stability. These 